I think most scientists will admit, maybe after three beers and in private, that you have to rely on intuition when you're working at the edge of the known because you can't rationally figure out what to do next. And so it's, science is portrayed and taught as though it is a rational sequence of steps that you follow. And part of that is true. There, that's what tools and techniques are all about. You follow certain steps. But when you're, when you're really dealing at the edge of the known, that's not going to work anymore. Because if it did work, then there wouldn't be the unknown anymore. You would figure out ways of just systematically pushing against it. So people rely on dreams and they rely on hunches and they sometimes will take something from one context and recast it as a metaphor and try that. There's all kinds of flailing around. And oftentimes the really interesting discoveries are completely serendipitous. Just you get a strange thought out of nowhere all of a sudden and you, you because scientists know a lot about their discipline, they figure out a way of crafting it and using it somehow in what they're doing. So I think most scientists work that way. It, but maybe we're not supposed to talk about it. Personally, I occasionally will get a dream and it's an unusual dream in the sense that I somehow know that it's correct. I don't know how I know it's correct. It just has a sense of, about it that is correct. This is sometimes called a noetic experience. It's the, the idea that you know something, you also carry, carries with it a conviction that you know that it's correct. And so if I get a dream like that, it has this strange quality, I, and especially if it's related to an experiment, I will then do the experiment, and more often than not, it actually works out exactly the way that the dream said it would work out. So I've, I've learned that over the years that I should pay attention to that because it's either bubbling up from my unconscious that's been working on something for a while or coming from who knows where, but it, it generally is right. And I don't think I'm unique in that either.